Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi Welcome to the 99 Names of Allah with me, John Fontaine. This series is brought to you by Humanity Care Relief. So please check out the work below, check out the links below and support us in the work that we do. The first name we're going to speak about is Al Ghani, the independent one. Allah is Al Ghani, the independent one who is totally independent and free of need from anything and everything. He is the one who has absolutely no need whatsoever from the creation. He is the one who is free from any poverty or need. The one in whose hand lies the treasures of the heavens and the earth and of this world and the hereafter. Allah is totally independent. SubhanAllah, Al Ghani. The next name is Al Qadir, the one who is fully able. There's nothing that he cannot do. There's nothing that can limit him from anything. He is able to do anything that he wills and nothing renders him incapable or wearies him. He is fully able. He doesn't sleep, he doesn't need rest. He is Al Qadir. The next name is Al Qahir, the invincible subduer, the one who subdues his creation from high above, the one whom everything submits willingly or unwillingly. Nothing can stop or repel what he ordains, what he decrees and nothing can depart from the decree of Al-Qahir. SubhanAllah, think of the name so far. Fully independent, fully able. Nothing can leave the decree of Allah. He is the invincible subduer. The final name for today is Al-Quddus the pure, the perfect one, the one who is pure and exalted and high above all impurities, the one who the noble angels venerate, the one free from any rivals, any consorts and even any children, the one who has perfection as his attribute, the one who is declared free of any deficiencies and imperfections. The one who is free from ha having anything or anyone like him. Allah is Al Quddus, the pure, the perfect. Make sure you take these names of Allah, learn them, use them in your dua, and make sure you make the most this Ramadan.